Hey guys, it's the 1st of November, and, and it's homecoming week! Yeah, yeah! Woo! Go Trojans! Yeah, yeah, yeah! Yes! Yes! I mean, what is this? And what's with this shirt? This is What's Up. What's up, Trebekah? Yeah! Seriously though, guys, homecoming's this week. Get excited and get out. Tonight there's a Didache in TSAC at 6.30. It's worth one chapel credit. So go to that if you like chapel, if you don't like chapel, if you need chapel credits. Tomorrow night, there's an election night returns party in Boone. So if you're interested in seeing who won the uh, local elections here and all over the country, go to that. Thursday night pretty much starts the big homecoming weekend ado stuff. 7 o'clock, singing in the rain, Benson Auditorium. 7.30, homecoming banquet in the quad. There's still tickets being sold, $20 for a single, $30 for couples. Those are going to be sold until Tuesday. So make sure, if you want to go to Homecoming Banquet, you got to get your tickets. They're not going to be sold forever, but until Tuesday. So, yeah. At 9 o'clock in Boone is the coronation. That's when we'll actually find out who the king and queen are. So, if you want to find out who that is, maybe it's you. Probably not. You would you'd probably know if you were going to be king or queen. But make sure you go to that, because it's going to be a lot of fun. Friday at 10 a.m. is the Founders Day Chapel. So Chapel this week is on a, you know, the Friday instead of the Thursday. Kind of, kind of different, switching it up for homecoming and all that. So make sure if you need some chapel credits to go to that. It's still a TCC. Following that, there's the pilgrimage to the grave of J.L. McClurkin. So make sure you do that if you uh, want to. At 4 p.m. is a homecoming parade. It's pretty self-explanatory. It's a giant parade. It's a lot of fun. So go to that if you like parades and homecoming. 5 to 7, this, this might be a little new for, for everybody, but uh, there's going to be a festival on the lawn outside Wagner, and uh, there's going to be this great big light presentation show thing. It's going to be kind of magical uh, that night, so make sure you go out to that. 9 o'clock on Friday, 9 o'clock, this is different, singing in the rain is happening. Also, 9 o'clock, in the gym, Trojan Madness pep rally. It's going to be awesome. There's going to be games. There's going to be prizes. There's going to be gallon challenge, all sorts of dodgeball. I don't know. It's going to be, it's going to be incredible. There's really no reason not to go. If you consider yourself a more maniac, or if you don't consider yourself a more maniac, maybe you should, then you should be there. Because it's going to be... Crazy. Cool. Crazy cool. There's going to be a bonfire afterwards. That's always a lot of fun. Bonfires. Who knew? Saturday, 12 p.m. is the tailgate. Right next to the gym, there's going to be food, hot dogs, hamburgers, that kind of stuff. So the calf will be outside that day. There will not be any regular calf eating on Saturday. 3 p.m., there's an afternoon performance of Singing in the Rain. So in case you have missed it up until then, you can see it then. Also, 3 p.m. is the women's basketball game, the Lady Trojans, and we're playing Mount Vernon, so make sure you come out to that. 5 p.m. is a men's basketball game, playing Michigan Dearborn, so go to that too, and make sure you're wearing your More Maniacs t-shirts, which will be sold this week at the SGA booth. They're only $5, guys. $5 for school pride, totally worth it, so make sure you get one. They are awesome. 7 o'clock, Saturday also, Singing in the Rain is happening, and then at 8 o'clock, there's this really cool uh, songwriter circle that's happening in Boone, and it's going to be so much fun, it's going to be awesome. So go out to that, support your local musicians. I hope you have a great week, I hope you enjoy homecoming. Get out! Go to the festivities, there's really no reason not to. If you're just going to sit in your room all day, you're probably not going to have any fun this week. But if you get out, have some fun, be a part of something that's bigger than you, bigger than your year, uh, it's, this is the Trebekah experience at its finest. So have a good week. From me and everyone else in the world, this has been What's Up. This is, ah, never know how to end this. That's, that's what's up. This has been, uh, that's what's up. La, la.